Good Friday afternoon, Western Montana. I'm Emily Foster, and this is the 406, the Missoulians weekday webcast. Here are the top headlines at this hour. The Custer County Sheriff says a missing University of Montana student died on impact when his Subaru went off a 60-foot embankment on Highway 21 near the turnoff for Stanley Lake in Idaho. The Custer County Coroner says the body of 21-year-old Lucius Robbie was recovered Thursday night after searchers in a private helicopter spotted the tip of a kayak in the trees. The accident is under investigation. Five Bozeman residents are suing the city, the mayor, and city commissioners, arguing the city did not have the legal authority to enact an ordinance that prohibits discrimination based on a person's sexual, sexual orientation or gender identity. In June, Bozeman became the fourth Montana city to pass an ordinance banning such discrimination in the workplace, housing, and public accommodations. Students at universities in Montana who are not old enough to purchase alcohol are required to take a new statewide tutorial this semester on the dangers and consequences of drinking. The Montana University System implemented the program at schools this fall. It requires students under the age of 21 on all state campuses to complete the two-part tutorial with a passing score. For the third time this summer, Yellowstone National Park rangers have cited a tourist for illegally flying a drone in the park. Park officials say an Oregon resident flew an unmanned aircraft over Midway Geyser Basin and near Bison on August 19th. And Grizz football season is upon us. Montana will face the Cowboys tomorrow at 2 p.m. in Laramie, Wyoming. The Grizz are coming off a 10-3 season and have a third-year starter in quarterback Jordan Johnson. But they'll face a hostile crowd in War Memorial Stadium, and the Cowboys are 9-0 in home openers. For details on where to watch the game, visit Missoulian.com. Have a great weekend, Western Montana. Check back with us on Missoulian.com for updates and breaking news. That's the 406 for Friday, August 29th, brought to you by the Missoula Building Industry Association. Mark your calendar for the 25th Annual Parade of Homes, taking place September 12th through the 14th. Visit BuildMissoula.com for more information and ticket locations.